it's Jojo from Mojo Jojo Plans and today I am doing a little bit different kind of video kind of a haul kind of a really simple haul I'm doing a haul for five dollars at Joann's so if you don't know and you don't have a Joann's but if you do know and you have a Joann's and you do shop at a Joann's and you use their app with their reward system you can get um, little rewards here and there for shopping and using your app like any coupons or even having them scan your rewards membership um, and then sometimes they'll have little challenges spend this amount and get a five dollar reward sometimes they have a ten dollar reward and sometimes they have a fifteen dollar reward and basically that's just like a coupon that you can use so like you can go and buy anything you want um, as long as it's five dollars you can use that reward and it takes off that five dollars and depending on how much it was you just pay the little whatever's left over it's so fun but I I thought it would be really fun to see what I can get for my $5. So Happy Planner stuff is on sale today for 40% off. So um, I like doing it during this time because the nice thing about this coupon is you can use it when things are on sale. So it works on sale items. So getting something at already a better price, right? Um, because you can't use any other coupons with it. So if I were to get something that was regular price, I wouldn't be able to use a 50% off first and then use this coupon. I would only be able to use this coupon. So my favorite time to use this type of reward is when stuff is already on sale. So I thought it'd be fun to run into Joann's and take you guys with me and see what I can find for $5. Hopefully we can find something cool. I do have the kiddo here with me today. Say hi. So this should be an interesting shopping trip with the kiddo, but I'm gonna get my mask on and I'm gonna head into Joann's. Okay, friends, so we are in the store. It looks like they moved some things around, so I'm just gonna rummage. So this coupon does not work on Clarence, but there is all this glorious Clarence here and it's still the additional 40% off. I'm so tempted so so tempted for some of these things like this it doesn't say what it is it's probably close to this 797 so it'd be like three bucks crazy but this coupon will not work on clearance so we got to find things that aren't on clearance that we can grab so here's another section these are all regular but they are 40% off. So these might be our best bet. So let's look around here. My store is like wiped out. So I could potentially get one of these. They are $6.99, so it'd be $4.19. And that would mean I would have to get one more thing with this to total the $5 um, for those. So I could. I don't know if I want that. But there's not a lot. There's not a lot left in Happy Planner World over here, that's for sure. So I'm just looking in all the normal spots. We're looking. I don't know what I want, honestly. I don't know what I want to get yet. But we shall find out and see. So lots of planners still. What does this sign say? Ooh, it says that planners are 50% off. And you guys, there is an additional 20% off. So that would be 60% off of planners. That's tempting. That's super tempting. So might have to look into that. I'm almost tempted to get another skinny mini. I'm almost tempted. And I'm almost tempted to get a skinny classic. I'm tempted, but I just don't know yet. I gotta see what all my options are first. So I don't know about your guys' Joanne, but mine locks up with these things, which is really annoying sometimes because it makes me not want to put the effort into getting a book because I have to go find somebody to get a book. So crazy. Okay, something else really also frustrating. We have 
all of this. All of these Happy Planet Girl stuff, and none of it is on clearance yet. How come? store is out of everything shocker right but what I was saying sorry I don't know if you could hear me but there's still some happy planner girl stuff that is still here and not marked down which is really annoying and they're not marked the 40% off that everything else is like why so I think I'm gonna get a tiny pad I think that's gonna be my choice because I can get more than one thing if I get a tiny pad. So I could either get a tiny pad or I could get envelopes. I'm thinking the envelopes because they're still under five and I absolutely love these ones. They are so cute. And because that is under five dollars, I'm going to get some scrapbook paper. Now I just need to decide which one I want because they are 79 cents for a good majority of them, which means I could get that and then only have to pay a little bit over what I would need. So I kind of want floral as always. <gasps> this one is gorgeous. Ooh, I love that one. I think I might get this one. Okay, so I think I got everything that I need. I don't think I need anything else. And I think I have what I can get with my $5 coupon. So I'm going to go check out and I will see you back when I get in my car. Okay, friends, so we are back in the car. Kids all buckled in and definitely ready to go home for sure. So um, I ended up spending a total of 63 cents of my own money after I put the coupon on. Not bad. And I used change because I have so much change and I was like, I'm gonna give you change because I have that exact change. And aren't we in like a change shortage? So I was like, I'm just contributing. My little contribution to giving back some change, I guess, I don't know. Um, so I went ahead and I snagged the envelopes. Um, I've been trying to take cash envelope system more seriously in my life. Uh, I'm hoping that it works a little bit better. Um, but I absolutely love this one, especially that floral one. Ugh, I freaking love it. So I got more envelopes. Super excited about that. And then I got this super, super, super pretty, really, really pretty, um, scrapbook paper, which I use in my memory planner a lot. So I got this one for that. But you guys, I didn't even notice this until after I bought it. Look. It has cute polka dots on the back, so it's like double-sided. Um, this was 79 cents. It wasn't on sale, but the envelopes were originally $7.99, and they were on sale for $4.79. So that's why I had to get something else, because you can't use that coupon if it's not totaling $5. So I ended up paying $0.63. Cents. Let me get my receipt here. And that $0.63 cents basically just came from the scrapbook paper, right? And then it came from tax. So it was 58 cents and then the tax that it added on brought it to 63 cents. So not too bad. So I know this was like, not like a crazy, like I'm buying all the things haul. I'm trying to save money for the next release that's coming out at the end of this month. So I didn't want to do like a huge haul. And like I said, my Joann's is pretty much cleared out or I have everything there that I actually want right now. So I'm not really like looking to grab more things until the end of the month, which I can't wait for that to, for all the new stuff to hit the shelves at Michael's. I'm so excited for that. Um, but I just wanted to do like a fun, like when I get this $5 reward, I'm going to use it. I don't even 
You know, like, don't let that go to waste. That's $5, right? I got envelopes and a cute scrapbook paper for 63 cents. I think that's a pretty good, that's a pretty good deal. So usually that's what I'll do to like save money here and there. Yeah, it's not a ton of money. And like, yeah, I still spent money. I know some people are like, you're not saving, you're spending 63 cents. And like, I know that, but I'm not going to let $5 go to waste and get something that I'll probably use. And if I don't use it, then I paid 63 cents for it and I won't feel bad about it. And if I end up giving it away, you know, but I'm planning to hopefully use those envelopes for some cash envelope system life that I'm trying to get my husband and I back on track with because we used to do really good before we had stinky Pete back here so um <laughs> but you know it's it's just life you know so I hope you enjoyed this little mini five dollar haul um I know I I'm a super self-conscious person so walking around in the store with a camera and trying to like talk to the camera is definitely not my strong suit and something I definitely am going to try working on because I do want to do shop with me's and like legit shop with me's especially at the end of this month when we get all this new stuff uh I just have to get used to talking to myself in public because I already feel weird sometimes when I talk to myself and it's with my kiddo. Um, <laughs> so, you know, I, that's just my personality. So, um, but I do hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And I hope I'll see you in my next one. Bye.